Okay, these are historic times. We're here in, at Lulz, but this is Jeff Mo, the CEO. I'll show you a couple of the production lines of the Taz 3D printer. Hi, Jeff. so we're here in Loveland, Colorado, uh, February 7th, 2014. Uh, Left Objects building a Lulzbot 3D printer, the Taz. Uh, this is our assembly line, which makes one Taz every 40 minutes. Uh, what else would you like to know? I'd like to know if you're actually open to helping us set up 3D printer production. Then oh, most certainly. So um, the design plans for the printer itself are all under free licenses as defined by uh, Free Software Foundation and Open Source Hardware Association. Um, so our parts are all under either the GPL uh, V3 or CC by SA Creative Commons and that's of the printer itself. And we're also making public the information on how to actually manufacture the printer. Uh, and we have OHAI kit, O H A I dash kit dot left objects dot com, which is a, a, a visual work instructions program, which is also free software, which shows you how to assemble various parts of the TAS and mm -hmm. the whole unit. Um, so, all that information is public as well. Please explain mm -hmm. to the skeptics how you keep in business. Um, we, by selling a quality product, by getting it out the door uh, to the customer in their hands, uh, uh, and competing by being faster, uh, integrating new innovation more quickly than everyone else. But the reality is you have competitors, but your biggest competitor is always yourself, right? So you have to really deliver uh, a solid package uh, for a reasonable price and give the customer true value uh, for what they're buying. And, some, and for many customers, that includes the fact that all of the uh, information about the printer itself is available under an open license. Do you promote that as part of your enterprise model, that you actually promote the openness? Uh, do you talk about it as why people should buy print? Yeah, printer? yeah, many people.